Johnny and June Cash's former property in Hendersonville is one of the most famous pieces of land in Middle Tennessee. And there's a plan in the works that would transform that piece of land by the lake, but not everyone's happy about it. Our Chris Cannon has this story. It's new for you at 6:30. Take a look at the amazing view of this property on Old Hickory Lake. The history is even more impressive. It is definitely an iconic property. This is where the home of Johnny and June Cash stood for more than three decades before it burned in 2007. Soon two new buildings could stand on this land. The concept is a residential treatment center. James and Gresham so has a vision for this, this historic Hendersonville property. You need an in, uh, kind of a homey feel, feeling in order to really heal. Um, so that, that's what this is. The Texas businessman wants to build an upscale treatment center for eating disorders with two buildings for patients on either end of the property. So I think the real opportunity is to build something like this and it continues the legacy or enhances the legacy and the story of redemption really that's in Johnny's music. The property's new owner says his goal is to preserve the history of this land that sits in the middle of a high dollar residential area. It's just, it's appalling to me. It's the place Chris Spencer planned to put his dream home. If they put a medical facility here, I, I can't see how I can build two lots away from a medical facility. Harry Adamson has lived here for 27 years and can't believe city leaders might let this happen. None of the residents knew this was happening. Uh, it needs to be investigated in depth as to what brought all this about. Gresham needs to have this property rezoned from residential to office zoning. He also needs to change the minds of his new neighbors. With most of the people, when I've been able to sit down and they actually hear what we're going to do and they see the renderings, then um, they, they get supportive. Only time will tell if he'll be able to change their view of his plans for this property. Gresham says he has the support of the Cash family, providing us with these quotes from Tommy Cash, saying, My brother and June would have loved to know their piece of property was being used for this. I want to be a part of this in any way I can to help out others. Then from their son, John Carter Cash, my parents would be in full support of this center. It is the perfect way to forward the integrity of their heritage. Now, there will be a public hearing on the rezoning of this issue on September 2nd. Back to you. Chris, thanks. Residents in that area have started a petition to stop the rezoning of the former cash property. If you'd like to look at it, we have a link to it on newschannel5.com.